Hey everyone, I was browsing Steam looking for something cozy to play, and lo and behold, I find the game called Cozy Typer. <laughs> um, I'll show you the game. Here we go. So we're basically just gonna type. It's a typing game, so we get like nice proverbs and sentences that we are gonna type. There's a story mode, which is supposedly very cute. This music is in the game. I want to show you guys the setting because they're pretty impressive. We can choose different cursors. I personally like this one. You have typing modes. You only type once. Errors cannot be corrected. Heart mode. Quotes must have 100% accuracy. I'm gonna go for chill today, so maybe someday we can go hardcore, but <laughs> for now. I will do all difficulties. That was the default settings, so that's fine. This is where it gets interesting. You can choose this little radio here. You can choose between different channels. So if you want jazz, do you want classical music? But personally, I really like the lo-fi. And then the visuals, we can also do a night mode. So if my eyes start hurting after a while, I can set it to night mode, but for now it's fine. You can even put in customized colors, whatever you want. You can put in your own hex code to really customize it. That's pretty impressive. Like I got into this game being like, well, it's very good reviews. People say it's a very like nice game to chill to um, and just have a little typing fun. So let's check it out. Okay, we got a message from Anita. Welcome. Hello there, lovelies. Welcome to my new course for all of you aspiring typists and enthusiasts alike. Ooh, a little bit of steam from the coffee. This course was made in the very same way I learned to type on my IBM Selectric back in 67, by typing out quotes from my favorite novels and films. My grandson Nathan did some of his computer magic. He's a real whiz at computers. And poof, there it was on my computer at home. I hope it brings you the same joy it brought to me when I first learned to type. The course will challenge you as you will need to pass every quote with at least 95% accuracy to finish each day. Don't worry if you fall below that, the quote will come back around for you to have another go at it. P.S. Don't rush or you will make mistakes. If you focus on your accuracy, speed will come naturally with time. P.P.S. You can only fail by giving up. I believe in you, Anita. Okay, so how do I do story? Oh, okay, here we go. So we need to do 12 quotes. Wait, I typed it. Hmm, weird. Thank God I can correct it. Yeah, it doesn't work. I need to press it and then press space. Was that a mistake? Oh, that was 93 accuracy. Oh. Well, to be fair, that was because um, I didn't realize I can't type and type and speak at the same time. <laughs> I didn't realize that the what is that thing? That a little icon um, needs a space of its own. Hey, 98.6. Achievement unlocked. Nice. I feel so accomplished. What am I actually typing? There is no greater agony than burying an untold story inside you. Ooh, that's dark. Ding, 100%. <laughs> My enemy is a notion, not a nation. Hindsight is always 20. Oh, I was trying to be so careful. Ooh, that was day one. I like typing. Grade A, 98.3. So that means I passed, right? Oh, it says your words for minutes too. Damn, this one was 108 for some reason. Hmm. Okay. So is this day two? Come on. Still passed. 
<laughs> Oops. Goo. <laughs> Shit, I did it again. Still 95.2. Thank God. Anyone who ever gave you confidence, you owe them a lot. What? Why are some of these so threatening? I don't know anyone. Shit. Nice. Still did pretty well. Just getting a hundred here and there. I wonder what the. Oh, damn it. <laughs> I wonder what the the really what makes it hard. Why are some? Is it spelling? But you can look right at it. Like, is it harder because it says 80? 80% 80 of success is showing up. I like that. That's that's me with my workouts. I keep telling myself, like, sometimes it feels like I don't make that much progress. I always kind of make progress, so it's good. But some days I'm just like, man, I still can't do a pull-up. Or, well, I can do one. But, like, it's hard to get over one pull-up. It's hard to get to two pull-ups. Um... But as long as I keep showing up, and as long as I keep working at it, eventually it'll happen. The most important thing is that I just keep doing it. Plus, plus because ultimately I'm just going to be healthier for it. One should always play fairly when one has the winning cards. What does that mean? If you tell the truth... You don't... Whoa. Oh! It's the same thing again! Damn it! Hakuna Matata! I know that one! It means... No worries. Be the change that you wish to see in the world! <laughs> Be kind, for everyone you meet is fighting a hard battle. That's very true. That was a good one. That's what I always tell myself. Everyone's dealing with their own shit. And we're all busy enough with managing our own lives as it is. Why would you go out of your way to criticize others? There's no point and nothing's gonna come of it, so... Just focus on your own life and your own happiness. That's all you need. Nice. Ah! Necessary to know its history. On the roll. Nice! <laughs> Thank you, game! <laughs> I'm trying! If you tell the truth, you don't have to remember anything. Huh. 99.1. Doing better, I think. Kinda. I went slower, though. I'm starting to be more careful. Oh, that was day three. I wonder if anything happens like after... I think it's a week, maybe? What is bravery without a dash of stupid? <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, I got three for that. Why? Quote flipper. Did he hear me? <laughs> Did you hear me say stupid? I don't want to survive. I want to live! This is um. This is actually bringing back memories, because this is literally what I used to do. Well, not not all I used to do, but a lot of times. So I used to be a project manager at a translation company. Yeah, and a lot of times clients would give like um. Would give a like a PDF. And then be like, we want you to translate that PDF. And we'd be like, do you have a word version? And then they'd be like, no. <laughs> so you can't put it in like translation software. Um, if it's just like um, a PDF, you can't edit the text. So we would have software that would re recognize the text and put it in Word, make it editable. Uh, but there are so many mistakes in it, and then certain sections will be like too, um, 
Like, you know, the really cheap scans, how they had like, like grime on it, like the black dusty grime. So that would sometimes go over words and you could still read it, but the software wouldn't. So then I would have to go in, look at the PDF and type those sections myself. Um, and sometimes you'd really just, well, a lot of times, um, you would just get like 25 page document that the software just couldn't do anything with. So I would just be like, for like a good hour or so, I'd just be like looking at it and like typing blindly. I would just keep going and going. <laughs> and I, I think that's, that definitely made me a better typer. Everyone thinks that the hero of their own story. I mean, yeah, that's the only brain you can read. I think that a lot. Whenever I go into town and like there's a bunch of people or you like happen to look into someone's like living room and you see like someone just like chilling, playing a game or watching TV. I always just think like that person is leading a whole dang life of his own and I'm leading my own life and he doesn't even know I exist. Um, there's one person who I always as there's one house I I'll walk I walk by a lot and I think the guy is a piano teacher and on some days I hear piano and that's why I like looked at the source of the sound and it's always like a teacher and like a young boy or girl playing um, which is such a nice little snippet of his life he has no idea I exist. Keep growing. Gortable. <laughs> Gortable magic. <laughs> if you look for perfection, you'll oh, never be content. Ooh, that one hits me in the face. All our words are about crumbs that fall down from the feast of the mind. Ooh, that's a good one. I like that one. Anything you're good at contributes to happiness. That is so not true. Excuse me, that's absolutely not true. You don't have to be good at anything. You can be really bad at puzzling, but still like it. What is that? It's not like you have to be a good artist to enjoy a, dra uh, enjoy a drawing or something. That doesn't... that clashes with the... you don't have to be perfect at things. What's so great about being serious all the time? Anyway, hell yeah. Time you enjoy wasting is not wasted time. Heck yes! You know more than you think you do. Oh, there's a kitty coming. Laughter is a day wasted. Hey, you want to type? We can try. Your paws might be a little big for the keys, though. Mm. What is a man? A miserable little pile of secrets. <laughs> When you play the game of thrones, you win or you die. That was week one. First week done. Yeah. Oh, the big boy. Hey. You want to type? Oh, he's typing. Where? Space. R space my space snacks with three X's. Ooh. Your first week. Congratulations! Excellent work completing the first week of my course. I'm so excited to be a part of your learning journey. Did you have a favorite quote so far? I hope <laughs> yes. Um, what was it? Um, men are just piles of secrets. <laughs> I hope you are ready. Next week's quotes are going to be a bit tougher. My favorite quote from this week is, trust yourself, you know more than you think you do. I like to think of this quote when I'm not feeling so great, as it reminds me that I know the way to back to happiness is long, so long as I trust in myself. 
you didn't see that one in the ex exercises, then it is waiting for you in free play along with all the rest of level one codes. Oh, so we did level one. It's going to get harder. Feel free to move on if you are excited to progress or take your time practicing the codes you have unlocked in free play. Don't forget, you can only fail by giving up. I believe in you. So, grade. I'm getting A's all around. Looks like I peaked on day five. <laughs> So this is level two. I wonder how many levels there are. Wasn't it like four or five? I will wear him. What? In my heart. Oh. <laughs> Originality. Then to succeed. Oh. So, oh, I typed success. Do you see that? Interesting typo. Imitation. That's like muscle memory, isn't it? Like... Your fingers are more used to typing success than succeed, I guess. Autobiographical. That's definitely a word I have to think about. Stink about. <laughs> what a stinky word. Oh, that wasn't that fast. I thought that was much faster. What? I did hit 117 there, though, with 100%. Ay. I was definitely a little bit faster, but not... It wasn't that crazy a difference, actually. Okay. Good start. <laughs> oh god, that's so such a hard fail. Ugh. <laughs> it's the end of the world as we know it. What is that from? And I feel fine. And that, I think that's our first. Oh god, quotations. Oh god. Rumpus. Oh, that was a tricky one. Ooh. Wait, and this is only day five, a week two. I wonder how many weeks there are. It's getting slower. <laughs> Ah, there's four weeks. So we're almost halfway through the game. Okay. Day six, almost there. Definitely just like speeding through now, which is nice. Okay, Sunday. <gasps> One more day to unlock level three. <sighs> Week two, oh my god. Halfway through the game. Fantastic work. Look at you, staying focused on your goals and working away at my course. I'm so proud of you. Week two was a bit of a step up, but you handled it with grace and you did not give up. What reminds me of an old quote. Be like the cliff against which the waves continually break, but it stands firm and tames the fury of the water around it. Mm. There are now even more difficult quotes available in free play. Perhaps give those a try and train up before moving on to week three. I got this. There's no rush. Just sit back, relax, and enjoy the moments you are making for yourself. Always remember, you can only fail by giving up. How did I do? 98. Definitely steadily in the 98 seems, <laughs> seems like there's no 100 or 90. There's one 90. Oh, that's interesting. I had my almost my highest streak when I was the fastest. So that was a good week. Good day. Okay, so I made it to level three. I think my hand needs a break. <laughs> my fingers are all like hot. <laughs> but I'm gonna do it. Now it's gonna be harder. There this is definitely much longer. Longer of a quote. Physics is like sex. Sure, it may give some practical results, <laughs> but that's not why we do it. <laughs> Blistering blue barnacles. I swear, as the last of the haddocks, I was thinking it was haddock. <laughs> I'll find that treasure before him. I find television very educating. Every time somebody turns on the set, I go into the other room and <laughs> read a book. <laughs> Phoebe, that was funny! Woo! Mocap. 
You have arrived. You want to type with me? The cuddliest bull. <laughs> cuddliest. <laughs> He's just like, hold me. <laughs> This little face. Oh, he's a tongue sticking out. Hey, your little tongue out. <laughs> he's holding my up my arm. He's like channeling cat power. They're good at running over keyboards. Yay! Nine words per minute. <laughs> that must have been BB. <laughs> Sometimes you just like nail a quote and you're fast and you do it 100% and it's just like, hell yeah. <laughs> Some books are to be tasted. Others to be swallowed. What quote is that from? Ooh, day five. Ding, ding, ding. Not too shabby. Non-conformists. Dedicated to justice, peace, and brotherhood. Oh, fuck. I watched some kind of show about like magic tricks and stuff. And what is real and how do they do it and stuff. And what always... I don't remember anything about the show, but I remember one moment the the narrator was like, what is the biggest lie in the world? And I was like, I don't know. And he said, it's money. Because here are these like coins and pieces of paper and everyone agrees on the lie that that paper is worth a certain amount. But in reality, the worth of the paper is not like that much. It's just paper with special holograms on it and shit. Um, but we all believe in the same lie that their values differ and you can get certain things with them. And I was like, yeah, technically, he's not wrong. And it really stuck with me. <laughs> Strong in will to strive, to seek, to find, and not to yield. It also makes you think about preppers when like people who need to be prepared for when the world ends i've seen i i watched a ton of those episodes because it's fascinating but a lot of them are like as soon as this happens money is not going to be worth anything and i was like because it's a lie <laughs> um but yeah and then instead of money um or they either like change their money into like bricks of gold or start a vineyard because they are like everyone will want to drink so then we can like um, exchange our wine for goods as money and I was like wow oh, people are really thinking about this stuff people fall in love without reason without even wanting to you can't predict it that's love <laughs> Day six. Ooh, we're almost at chapter four. <laughs> I get so lost in these things. I'm like, just, I'm just happy just typing. <laughs> it's so chill. What is a man but the sum of his memories? We are the stories we live, the tales we tell ourselves. Wow. Be as simple as you can be. You will be astonished to see how uncomplicated and happy your life can become. Oh, I really like that. Never give up. If you keep trying, you will ultimately enjoy success. Yes, I didn't mess it up. I think I'm getting better. I think I'm getting a be becoming a better typer. <laughs> I think it's working. Oh, hey, that was the end of the third week. Impressive progress. I am elated to see that you've officially passed the halfway point of my little course. 
that was the halfway point? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I hope you are finding yourself slowly improving and that you are still focusing... Is that with two S's? This looks so weird. On your accuracy. I'm sure you've noticed that the quotes have been getting a little longer. Yeah, I, like, typed a book over here. Uh, trickier as you've progressed. You'll find that the quotes in the final week follow the same pattern. I encourage you to focus on each word instead of worrying about the quote in its entirety. If you can take on a word at a time, you can take on any number of words. Just go with the flow and try to avoid rushing. That's kind of nice. This reminds me of my favorite quote from this week. We delight in the beauty of the butterfly, but rarely admit the changes it has gone through to achieve that beauty. You may see others typing faster than you, but I assure you, they spend time working on their accuracy first too. Don't forget that you can always practice in free play if you feel a desire. I've said it before and I'll say it again. You can only fail by giving up. I believe in you. How have I been doing? Oh, that's... I think... I feel like I'm getting quite steady. <laughs> Yeah, this is a steady pace. Streak, 16, 20? Damn. So this is, this is the last week. We can do it. With these 10 guys, I can type. Here we go. The glasses are on. <laughs> not that they're just blue light glasses, they're not. <laughs> No prescription glasses or anything. I actually, fun fact, I am not allowed to wear prescription glasses at the computer because I am slightly cross-eyed. And I didn't know that. And apparently if you, I only, I only don't see well far away, but apparently yeah, the curvature of the glass um, could maybe make my cross-eyedness worse. That's oh, that was such a fail. That's uh, I do like my blue light glasses because they're slightly tinted yellow. I don't think blue light is harm harmful or anything, but it does like make everything a little bit softer to look at. Just the tiniest bit, and I like that. It's a nice feeling on the eyes. I feel like my eyes can relax a tiny bit when I wear blue light glasses. A lot of times I can kind of feel a headache coming on. Because I think the harsh lights are kind of making me tense up a little bit. Um, and so wearing these glasses who are a little, that make everything a little bit softer makes me relax. And I think that's why the headache goes away. I, I've gotten to the point now where I'm just typing. And I, I'm not even processing what the quotes say anymore. I'm just following letter for letter. <laughs> I'm just typing away. I have transcended. <laughs> Day one. Level four. That's not too bad. I think it's because the quotes are getting longer, so the mistakes don't count as heavy. Some men are born rich. Rech. I'm born rich. Bum enough. <laughs> It would actually have been so cool if this was actually a story. Like, it starts with quotes, but then um, slowly, like, one quote links to another, and then it's like, or someone is like, are you there? You could really do something with this. I'm, 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 I think there are typing games like that, though, where you type through a story, right? I've never really played them. Isn't there, like, Typing of the Dead or something? I've always wanted to play it, but I never, I never ended up doing it. Should I? Anyone played that one? Top 15 things, money. Oh, look at this one. Oh, can't buy time, happiness, inner peace, integrity, love, character, manners, make it man, health. Respect, morals, trust, patience, class, common sense, dignity. Boom! You can't kill me. I have 10 fingers. Okay. Well, 94.2. 100. I only got two hundreds. That was day two. Okay. Four days to go.
Almost three hours? I thought this game was an hour. <laughs> I've been typing for three hours. <laughs> God, what can I say? I like typing. <laughs> As you can see. I love. I have loved. I will love. <laughs> There's a space there? That's just unfair. Excuse me? Gotta type them all. Achievement unlocks. Hmm. Wait, let me check. Complete 500 quotes. That's a lot. Oh shit, I did 500? My hand's so tired. Day six though. One more day. <laughs> my right hand's absolutely fine. My left is tired. But I am right-handed, so... Maybe these tendons are just stronger. Perhaps you will gradually, without even noticing it, find yourself experiencing the answer some distant day. That was it. You did it. Achievement unlocked. <laughs> Exemplary work. Look at you go. I couldn't be happier to see my first student make their way through the full course. I've been watching your progress intently and I'm proud of you for making it all the way to the end. Watching you filled me with nostalgia for my time learning how to type. And it blows my mind that you can have my little course on your home computer with all this newfangled technology. Back in my day, I had to go all the way to the studi study hall to use a grammar school's typewriter before I saved enough money to buy one for myself. Just this week, my grandson introduced me to this lo-fi music. <laughs> I find it quite relaxing and it brings back so many memories of my younger days. Perhaps it's the relaxing nature of the music. You should try listening to some while you practice. I did. Oh gosh, look at me waffling on. I am just so very happy to see how far you've come and I'm very much looking forward to watching your, you, your progress in your graphs and hopefully those streaks go up too, my lovely. I will leave you with my favorite quote from the final week's selection. Simple can be harder than complex. You have to work hard to get your thinking clean to make it simple. But it's worth it in the end because once you get there, you can move mountains. I did type that, yeah. <laughs> it's definitely harder to slow down and get the simple things right. But I hope you've seen the value of focusing on the simple accuracy and the effect it has, it has its had on the mountains. Speed. Perfect practice, practice makes perfect. Always remember, you can only fail by giving up. I believe in you. That's it. Well, I think I just got A ranks all around, right? I wonder if you can get an S rank if you get 100%. Hmm. Damn. That is so many things. Main menu. Story completed. Message from Nathan. Thanks for doing my grand's course. She was bragging about you the whole time, lol. Going on about her first students getting really good grades. Pretty cool to see that you did 537 quotes through the whole thing. 98.4 accuracy. Ain't bad either. That's pretty good, honestly. <laughs> you should try out hard mode. That way you gotta be really accurate if you want that sweet ding at the end of each one. I think I put that in the typing part of the settings menu. Anyway, good luck with the rest of your typing stuff and thanks again for making my grand so happy, Nathan. Oh, that was fun. So we have free play inbox is just this. Oh, you can go between all the emails, I see. Stats, all time, whoa. So these are my average, my average words per minute. So I guess it's like here. So 80, but it was also, yeah, because I had to be careful. <laughs> that is cool to see. What is this one? What did I do? <laughs> oh, 90 errors. Oh, wait. Oh, so space. T. And A are my most common errors. That's so interesting. What's my least? Oh, X. Well, X is also just not used that much. I am gonna do a test. 91. Well, I 
think I can be a little faster than that, but I'm gonna leave it here. I tried, my hands are also so super tired. I've been typing for three and a half hours. <laughs> That's so crazy. <laughs> I can't believe I ended up doing that. I mean, we're gonna just take out a whole ton of it because it's all just like typing quotes. Some bits are really funny. Um, so we'll use those and I hope you guys just liked it. Um, consider getting the game for yourself because I, I do really think it's really nice to just have a little I, sh I don't know I like typing obviously um, so it's kind of nice to have a game like that to just like go to where it's completely like no time limit completely stress-free nice chill music and you just type away I feel like it could be a really nice distraction there are other typing games that might be really fun and I'd be super down to try them out, but this let's use this as a little test bed to see if there's interest for a thing like this. Um, I had a great time. Thank you so much for watching this weird little game. It was really fun. Leave a like if you enjoyed it and thank you for watching.